Hey guys, welcome to the first video on this course. So to get started, we need to open SketchUp once we've installed SketchUp. And also a heads up, we'll be using the Windows version of SketchUp in this course. Although I'm also going to be showing you the Mac versions for certain functions in SketchUp. So to get started, let's open SketchUp Pro 2021. So generally, once you install, you'll find the icon in your desktop. So you can double click to open it up. And once it opens, you may need to register your email ID in case you're opening it for the first time and then log in with that email ID, which is what you used to download and install SketchUp. And once you've registered, you can start your 30 day trial license. So once you've done all of that, it's time to select our template. Now you can see that SketchUp comes with a lot of templates. Now, if you want to see additional templates, you can click on more templates and you can see the other templates out here. So each of these templates have different kinds of background colors, starting views, units of measurements, tags, and a lot more. It's also got a scaled 2D figure. In this case, it is Sumele. And here's a fun fact. So every year they publish a new 2D figure and those 2D figures are actually employees working in the SketchUp office. So they're actual people and they have themselves represented in the software. Now, if you want to change the default template in SketchUp, you can change it by clicking on this heart symbol here. So it changes the default template. And the next time, now for example, if I open this, and the next time you open SketchUp or you click on File New, it's going to load in with the metric units. Now, if you want to change the default units, simply go to Help and click on Welcome to SketchUp. And then you can change the default units again. So in our case, we're going to use the simple inches or you can also use the architectural inches. It's pretty much the same. So we are going to use simple inches. So once you've selected your template, just click on the box here and it would open the template. Now, if you want to change the units after you select a template, which I would not recommend is you go to windows, click on model info, and then you click on units and you can change the template here as well. But I would suggest that you change the template right off the bat before starting any project. And for this course, you're going to be using the simple inches units. And for all those who work with metric, do not worry because I will be translating the units every time I get a chance. And I'm also going to show you something in SketchUp, which is really cool, where you can use both the metric and the imperial units while modeling in SketchUp. I'm also going to get rid of these plugins for now because we don't really need them for the basics course I will be using them in the main course so the next video I'm going to introduce you to the SketchUp interface and talk brief about the interface so I'll see you guys in the next video cheers